Hey there, YouTube. It is I, True Stealth, and we are back with another episode of Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battles, the episode mode. And I know it's been a very long time since I passed it. It's been months. But things have been happening, and I've finally been able to get back into recording videos again. So I'm quite happy. Uh, I haven't even gone for a recap because I kind of just wanted to get back in this and kind of feel what's going on. So, let's just jump back, back into it. back here again? Seriously? At least those guys we met here are gone. Maybe they're looking for us. Yeah, no thanks. I don't want to have to deal with them again. I actually kind of want to get a rematch with Makoto, this time without using my persona, using only my kicks, like, Hucha! Yeah, you'd lose. Or worse, you'd die. That girl's moves were on another level. I'd be fine. If she's that strong, she must know how to fight without hurting her opponent too bad. Aww. <laughs> well, that's optimistic. <laughs> you probably won't see her again before we're out of here. But if you do, go for it. But for real, though, it sucks that Teddy isn't here. If we were inside the TV right now, he'd probably be able to pop us right out of here. Yeah? Yeah. It's a shame we don't have Teddy-san or Risei-chan to guide us. Right? It feels like they're being left out. It's not fair. Oh. Yeah, when is Risei coming? Welcome back, Narukami-kun. Hmm. Can I really say welcome back when we're in another world? I'd say so. Welcome back, Narukami-kun. Honestly, with everything that's happened, it really doesn't feel like it's been that long. Nope. Hey, if we get out of here, do you think we'll wind up back in our homes? It'd be cool if we could all hang out at Inaba again. Well, that might make it hard for Narukami-senpai to get back to the city. Yeah, that would be cool. I'm fairly used to the commute, so I could show him the easiest train route back. Huh. Oh, now it's her. Hey, Narukami-kun, if you do get to come back to Inaba with us, let's all go get some beef bowls on Hanumara's tab! <laughs> Hell no! I don't have that kind of money. I'll cover Narukami's and that's it. Oh, don't be so stingy. Fine. How about the food court at Juness? It'd feel more like an investigation meeting that way, too. Oh. No, that's been Hello, Miss Satonaka. Are you listening? <laughs> nice to see you guys haven't changed. Uh, hate to crash your little party, but... Who? Oh, you scared the shit out of me. <clears throat> Who are you anyway? I'm Rob. Tatsumi-kun. Calm down. He doesn't seem hostile. Hey, Naoto, that sounds less convincing when you've got your gun drawn. Guess none of us can help it. I've got my knives out, too. They're ready for battle. Oh, just look at the guy. He looks super strong. And that weapon of his is huge. Yep. Oh, it's red. I think it's sort of charming. Charming? Calm down. I'm not here to fight. Yes. So you have no intention of taking our keystone. Well, if you just wanted to give it to me, I wouldn't complain. We can't do that. We have to get back to our original world. Hmm. Yeah, I figured as much. Okay, so this is really interesting because we have gone through the Blaze Blue story, and this never happened. So I know what I've been talking about before in the early episodes about how there's been some big questions about what exactly the continuums are between these and there's been like some things that seem like it could work and things that seem like it can't work and i feel like with this one scene alone we can just completely say that each and every episode is completely separate well no not completely separate from the rest of them but they are running completely different scenarios which i guess uh is kind of interesting considering how the universes work and the fact that all tier. here
but it also brings the question of like is this a running simulation are these like multiple timelines is the timeline being reset every time they break a crystal are all these people even in one world like together or is each like randomly growing through pretty much the only like only people in that world except for maybe like two or three other people there's a lot of questions that still need to be answered and I feel like it's going to be fun finding them all out. Still, I'm not gonna take your keystone. I got one of my own anyway. Take a look. Huh? That's the same stone Narukami's holding, but it's a different color. So there really are multiple keystones. I think it's safe to say that he's not our enemy. If he's after the keystones, showing us his is far too brazen. And if it's a trap, it's a sloppy one. <laughs> I'm not trying to trick you. I'm just saying I'd take your keystone if you didn't want it, but I don't really give a damn. Then why did you come talk to us? I've been told to collect the keystones, but something seems off to me bugs me that she's on the move too she who's he talking about i don't know it must be an acquaintance of his acquaintance. anyway yeah. this guy actually seems like he wants to talk i mean i know our track record hasn't been great but maybe we should give it a try <laughs> that would help yeah. unfortunately not really anyway i'm you narakami ragna the blood edge <sighs> What? Are you a foreigner or something? <laughs> a foreigner? He's from a completely different world! <laughs> wow, that's still hard to wrap my head around. And should I call you Ragna-san? Uh, drop the sun. Ragna's just fine. So, you're Narukami? You? Mm -hmm. Well, whatever you want to be called, you're wrapped up in this thing too. Damn rabbit. She won't explain a thing. Rabbit? You mean that girl wearing the bunny ears? Rachel? Yep. That's the one. Yeah. Did you run into her? Calling her girl makes her sound way too innocent. <laughs> that rabbit's trying to collect all four keystones, but... There are four? So all we were told was that we were supposed to take this keystone and head to the goal. We didn't hear a thing about collecting them. And every time we meet someone, they try to take it away, so we've been running at the soonest chance we get. Yep. Damn. Seems like a pretty smart move, though. Everyone in this world is kind of crazy. If kids like you tried to take them on for real, you wouldn't be walking away so easily. <sighs> Screw you! We haven't lost a single match so far. Tatsumi-kun. We finally met someone we can talk to, so let's try to stay amicable. So, it seems you're trying to collect all of these keystones too. Are you sure that you can afford to talk to us like this? Eh. Eh? Take this seriously. Hey, I'm a victim here too, you know. I've got no idea what's going on. That's why we gotta find that rabbit. Come to think of it, she really was acting strange. She seemed kind of overwhelmed and <laughs> flustered, and she was even cagier about things than she usually is. Yeah, because it has to do with I'm her. Just about it pisses me off. She's always making me do her dirty work for her. But you get it done. Once all this is settled, I'm gonna make her cry. That'll show her. <laughs> um, does that mean? You cooperate with us? I don't know about this. He's talking to us now, but at the end of the day, he still wants the keystone, right? What? Uh, if you guys want it, you can keep it. Excuse me? I mean, we weren't about to hand it over, but I expected you'd care a little more. I'm guessing that it's more important that they're all together than it is that one person have them. Yeah. That's very logic. So whether you have it or I have it, won't make much difference. 
Really? But if I let you keep it, you guys have to follow me. If you guys lose your keystone or someone takes it from you, it's not going to be good. And if you don't want to do that, well, I think you know how this will go down. I'll follow you to where? First to the of all, gate. we'll find the rabbit. You know she's got to be holding on to something important. Hey, what should we do? What if we follow the stranger and he doesn't just take our keystone, but also our skulls? I'm not even kidding. Do you really think it's okay? <laughs> Honestly, I don't think we have anything to worry about from him. Probably. Agreed. He doesn't look like a bad... Well, he doesn't seem the type to stab someone in the back, at least. We'll need to use caution. But everything he's done so far makes me think that he'd be a worthy ally. Either way, we won't be able to find the skull all by ourselves. I think following Ragnason and asking Rabbit Son for a proper explanation is a good idea. Yeah, once we do that, we can figure out our plan. Works for me. You'll never know what's in the hole if you don't jump in. <laughs> Rabbit I'm not hole. following you into any holes. <laughs> you guys finished Good hashing choice. things out? Yeah. We'll take you up on your offer. But let's each hold on to our respective keystones, okay? Those stones are mine! Ruby! Who's that? Again. Actually, really cool. This isn't the time to admire her. She's attacking us. Ah, stay focused. Oh, now what? Well done. I tried attacking you from your blind spot, but you're quicker than you look. Sorry, I messed up, Weiss. Don't worry, I accounted for that. Plan B. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be fun. No matter what world we're in, we will not allow evil to go unpunished. Oh, the wrong is not evil. Now, hand over that keystone at once. <sighs> this looks like trouble. Yeah, it definitely is. To justify your evil schemes. Weiss is right. We won't let you use that keystone for evil. We're going to keep this world safe. Evil? Since when are we the bad guys? <laughs> I'm guessing that the voice gave them bad info. It's like that Taker guy said. Oh gosh, this is different timeline. I believe we may have been given conflicting information. Oh, so does that mean that each combatant was given different instructions? But to what end? I don't know, and I don't care. Punks like this don't listen until you rough them up a little. Wow, Ragnason, you're awfully physical. Just hold on to your stone and stand back. I've got this. Not without my help. I'm not gonna let you fight alone. What, really? Be careful, partner! Give me a tag! Give me a battle! battle. Give, Give me, me a, a tag, tag battle. battle! Did you know that tag and battle are the Phantom Field's primary exports? Phantom well, Field? Get that factoid out of the way. Let's get our entrance ready to roll! Hmm. You stupid, voicey bastard! Stop being so excited about all this! Doesn't matter to me. I've got to do what I've got to do. Just make sure you pull your weight. If you're gonna fight, then fight! There's no way we'll lose! Get ready! Uh, they're both Get really strong. Ready. Let's just go with Ragnar. Okay. They're gonna have some good mix-ups, but I doubt it should be anything too worrisome. Let's see. Can't escape from crossing fate. Ah, uh, uh, yes. 
Wait, I? Oh, I messed up that combo. Dude. Oh, I would her hit me. Oh, that's not good. Never mind. Oh, wait. Wow, that's actually Oh, wait, I messed up. But. I'm just gonna finish this right here. Oh. I didn't realize that that was a lower thing attack. I really don't use you enough, I guess. But quick battle. Really quick. Way too quick, actually. Dang it! I can't give up yet. Yeah. And with that, that is the end of the episode a uh, very quick ending we just ended straight with a battle no extra dialogue just went straight to chapter seven after that so that was an interesting conclusion and the battle was pretty simple too uh overall i enjoyed the dialogue because we got like a little back and forth we have all the group conversation got to see all the dynamic skin and of course they brought up the question of Where's Teddy and Lise? Of course, we know that Teddy was as you'll see later, and we should be seeing him in part two. But the question of where Lise is is still very big because we haven't gotten her as DLC, but we do know she is in Persona 4 Arena, so I I don't see a reason for her not being here. Like, if they, I hope they totally do bring her here. In fact, it'd be great even if they brought uh, for some of five characters in here too, but that's something we'll have to see in the next episode. So, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll catch you all again.